He is examining one of the framed photographs on display, but quickly returns it to the shelf as Martin answers. Wasn't sure whether I'd see you here today or not. Oh, I can leave. Come on, man. That's not what I meant. Look, I just thought you might have forgotten to pick me up or something. No, you thought I left your ass here to get back to the campus the best way you could. Okay. And I should have. You know, you didn't have any problem saying what you meant last night. So don't stop now. All I said last night was that you need to try to be a little bit more discreet. That's a joke coming from you. You wouldn't know discretion if someone glued it to your jock strap. <laughs> Hell, if I wasn't discreet, I'd have made it in time for your little media event. Provided some real color commentary. <laughs> You know, I wasn't worried about that. And I'm not worried about you. See, nobody's going to clock you. But you have to admit that some of those guys you've been hanging out with lately, man, they seem kind of out there. Why? Because they're willing to stand up for themselves and not be intimidated by any of these religious reactionaries or, or, or hip-hop hypocrites or any of these uh, pseudo-nationalist bullies at school? Man, if I had a dollar for every brother out in court cruising off campus that hour, mm -hmm. I wouldn't have to worry about it. Hello. Hello. All right. I'm forced to be alone. I can't even have to worry about this little work study job. Mm -hmm. But I'm saying, what's with all the meetings at Blackburn? And the demonstrations? I just don't see where it takes all that to be accepted. Mark. Man, I don't care about being accepted by a bunch of homophobic assholes. But I refuse to be ignored or remain unacknowledged. Hell, we pay student activity fees just like everybody else. And they better start recognizing. Oh, is, is that why you're hanging with that bunch of misfits? So you can be recognized? Oh, I don't need that kind of attention. I, I didn't even see them carrying on and breaking the chapel. Hand up with the chair. Martin, how would you know what they do? Unless you compete with the five kilo. See, you win. You win. I can't talk to you when you get like this. Oh, well, would it be easier for us to communicate if you let the chat in the works? Oh, you heard what I said. Look, I, I don't know what your little spies have been no, telling you. Don't flatter yourself. I haven't forgotten how old you've been. Oh, man. <laughs> that again. Am I ever going to live that down? Look, I haven't been over there in ages. Not that I wouldn't be justified. Martin, please. You have to be cruising the dessert stacks and founders lately. Oh, all right. <laughs> <laughs> it's only because you discovered that and then you your side space. You know, you really ought to be careful about leaving the computer on with the name of us. Oh. Unless she sees you on the evening news. Mm -hmm. You know what? 
If you don't stay away from the Latino part, <laughs> the campus glory holes, <laughs> your exploits have been hard copy way before mine. I'm not talking about the sports set. <laughs> well, for the record, just who named you role model for the militant black gay college students? Before you met me at the Penn Hill Street ago, he never even had sex with a dude before. That doesn't mean I hadn't thought about it. Yeah, and if I hadn't come along and rocked your world, <laughs> you still be sitting there thinking about it. having sex with females. Man, you'd still be straight. I wasn't straight then. I just was celibate. <laughs> Maybe not, but I'm the one you'll always remember. 